Hello everyone, this is Spiros from Orthopedic Reflexology. I'm on the road with Team Greece. There's an important game today with Iceland, qualifying game. And our team captain has his very kind because he has some time with us. Uh, because I want to share some information with you what I'm doing today. So there was a recent research, uh, well actually from 23, 2023, and it had to do with fMRI. I know you've all heard of Kevin Kunz's research, but there was one from France, Toulouse, and they did this functional neuroimaging of the brain while working on the feet. And what they saw was that there was a neural network correlation. There are many networks in the brain. And when we, it seems when we do sham reflexology, foot massage or reflexology, uh, these networks combine together and then work together. Our team captain now in this European handball, it's very important to have all these networks going because the players use their hands, they use their feet, and it's even more important for players in the position of what we call playmaker. He makes the play, he makes the game. So how he is coordinated and how he has the strategy, where his players are, where the opponents are, the system is going on. So this was what I was working on with our team captain because he is a handball player, because he is the playmaker, and because it's good for everyone. What is interesting is what they worked on in the research, and this is the part I want to share with you, they would work the spinal area from the cervical region down to the cortex area, and then come back up. But they do a loop here, a loop which re reminds us of the urinary blad bladder. Excuse me reminds us of the kidney meridian that makes the loop here. So I find it interesting, I will add in the comment section the picture with the chart, you've already seen it if you've been following my work, but you can see it again in the comment section and you will observe that they work partially on the spleen meridian and then it becomes the kidney meridian and I really enjoy this trajectory they have of coming in and working around these acupuncture points which belong to the kidney meridian and it's always good for his stamina which we will need tonight to get things going because my star player has to go and rest before the game we are before the game the second place they would work on would be diaphragma so they would begin kind of medially go up the arch come down to the tuberosity of the fifth the metatarsal, and then from plantar they begin medially and go laterally, and from laterally, let's show it on this foot, and from laterally the arch again going medially. And using these two combinations they saw that the neural networks would work together, and that's why I'm doing it on this player and on many players also. For regarding the second area, plantarly, the diaphragma line, and dorsally, go look at the arteries of the foot. You will see the uh, arcuate artery on the top and on the bottom the plantar arch artery. And I know it's blood circulation with its benefits, but the arteries are with nerves, and I remember sympathetic nervous system, just looking at the correlations. If you like my approach, uh, you can come to a course in London, Toulouse, I'm going to Krakow in Poland, which is a new city, see you soon there. And also in Athens in April from the 11th to the 13th, I have a course in Athens and the ICE after the ICR conference in September. So, again, doing the movement, I'm kind of going kind of fast climbing up, you would have to change your hands to come down, go up again, and to the top, and going down. I will add the picture in the comments. Thank you to our team captain. He is an ambassador of reflexology. He is an ambassador of reflexology. I've known him from 2011, giving him reflexology since then. And he's been very supportive in my, for my work, and I love him for that. Together See, until the end. <laughs> See you. Thank you. Bye-bye.